It's Mountain Dew Fan 108 here again with another Generator Rex X figure review. And this time I'm going to give you a look at the Smack Hands Rex. Probably my favorite little, like, attachment that he has because they're just awesome. Giant hands, big smashing. So, before I get to the figure, I'm going to look at the box quick. Um, we've got the nice gear packaging with the. Gen nice Generator Rex up there, then you've got Generator Rex logo there, um, you've got Cartoon Network logo, his name Smack Hands Rex, and then it says, the sticker over here says, includes Rhino Evo. So, that's pretty much it on the front. On the back you've got Generator Rex logo, and then it's the same um, little splee here as the first one. Is the first one. If you haven't watched it, um, look it up. Uh, it's in there. Uh, and then you have all the other sets you can get. Um, so yeah, I might be getting the big fat sword. Rex does. It's just cool sword. But I don't know. Maybe two uh, But yeah, that's pretty much it on the packaging. Nice small packaging. Not giant or anything. Nice. Um, but, and I'll give you a look at the Evo, the Rhinor Evo. This one's way cooler than the other one, because it's more of an animal shape-ish Evo, and it has a giant horn, but, yeah, I'll give you a good, like, 360 look at it quick. Yeah, I like it. Just wish they were bigger. I just, like I said before, I just wish that they'd have them as a normal sized character instead of these little mini ones. Kind of like the Secret Saturday line, but I didn't get any, unfortunately. So, um, but anyways, back back to this. Uh, there's his Evo that he comes with. Pretty cool looking. Um, now, to the figure himself, like I said before, this is probably one of my favorite little attachments that he does or uses because it's just awesome and then I like how he can like I don't know how what would you call it but he can like make his fist spin and it's like a drill and stuff it's pretty cool I wish they'd spin so it'd be kind of a little cool little detail that they'd have on there but yeah um the articulation the articulation for this figure is swivel head swivel shoulders single jointed Single joint elbows, uh, swivel hips, no knee, ankle articulation. Um, so the detail on his arm is really nice. I don't know how you see it, but it's really nice. Um, and then the other thing about this figure is he's hard to stand up if you have his fist outwards because he's top heavy. So you either have to have like his hands like this. I don't even know if he can stand up like that, but. He'd have to have his hands like behind him or something like that, or like in an upward position, kind of like that, I guess. I don't know. Or you could even have him up like this, like he's ready to smack something or he's lifting something up. But yeah, um, the, even the detail on the face is really nice. Just they do, they did a lot of good detail on the figure that is so small, and then even on the pants, and even the shoes. Really nice detail. Just they did a good job on the detail. Um, so yeah, that's pretty much it for the figure, I guess. Um, not much else to talk about, but but yeah, pretty awesome. Wish it was. Wish the price wasn't so expensive, but you know what can you do? Not really anything, but um. um so that is pretty much it for this review. Kind of short, but thanks for watching. Keep collecting, and bye.